Um, so Jake, I know I touched on it and I thought that with Gibbs that um, he's basically replacing DeAndre Swift. And I would expect that type of role. Um, how do you feel about him? And or what are your expectations for him for this season? I think it's a little simplistic to say that David Montgomery is Jamal Williams. Jamar Gibbs is DeAndre Swift. But I understand the impulse and the implication of it. I always understand the implication. But I think I think that Jameer Gibbs presents more upside than DeAndre Swift, not because he's a totally different player or better player, but because the coaching staff hopefully doesn't think that they have to mitigate his workload as much as they did DeAndre Swift. Like with all of his injuries that were happening the last couple of years, coaching staff was mm-hmm. pretty upfront about it, saying like, yeah, we – we want to, you know, keep him healthy. We want to be able to utilize him from the start of the season to the finish. That meant he wasn't going to get a crazy workload. For fantasy, we just cared about the passes for mm-hmm. the most part. We cared about his receptions. Jameer Gibbs should absolutely have that role. I do start to wonder how much he cuts into what I thought was going to be a prime role for David Montgomery before he was drafted, before Gibbs was drafted. I thought David Montgomery was getting undervalued probably by the community for this year because I thought he was going to take on dual workloads of the Williams mm-hmm. plus the the Swift to some extent. Now I'm not so sure uh, if I want David Montgomery at all on my teams because I think he is going to be a little bit more touchdown dependent. To your point, probably like Jamal Williams. Mm-hmm. So just – for reference, uh, DeAndre Swift finished as RB21 last year. Do you think that's a good floor or ceiling for Gibbs? If you are drafting Gibbs at what his ADP is likely to be, that has to be his floor because otherwise you're going to be very disappointed. Mm-hmm. I do think that it probably is much closer to his floor than his ceiling. I, I think a top 12 season is for sure within his range of possibilities just depends on what we see from them during training camp, what we mm-hmm. hear about David Montgomery. How much do they fawn over this guy? Right. And, or I is mean, he just healthy? Yeah, yeah I, I think the one thing that really detracted from Swift last year was Jamal Williams, you know, having, what, 17 touchdowns? So, right. I mean, even if you would have given four or five to Swift, I mean, that would have jumped him up, you know, in the total points quite a bit. So... Uh, it'll like you said, it'll be interesting to see on how that all shakes out and